Hello. I talked about how men like to wear my scarves too, and why not? They all deserve a bit of colour. Not everything of mine is absolutely in your face colour. And Richard's picked up a We've swapped roles. I'm cameraman. Richard is model today. He's picked up one of my silk squares, my new trompe l'oeil silk squares, and he's going to repeat the modelling of how you wear it as a cravat. Very simple. It's folded in four, so you've got the nice thick weight. He's simply knotting it, and there you go. Nice splash of colour round the neck, nice and comfy, and light to wear. So, I mentioned my long silk scarves. These are the crepe de chine silk scarves and here's one that Richard wears LA style. That means you fold it in half and you simply pull it through that loop and you get the similar effect to the cravat but because it's a lighter scarf you've got less sort of flamboyancy. And the, what Richard likes is to wear my velvet scarves in the garden because they're light, they're colourful, but they're easy to wear and give a lot of warmth that it's a bit chilly. Simply wrap around the neck and tuck in the loose bits because you don't want them getting mixed up with the secateurs. So doesn't that look great? Why not be stylish when you're in the garden? I tell you, we watch art in lockdown with Philip Mole. Hasn't he got a collection of scars? But I tell you what, Richard's got more. This is his very own pashmina. I'm showing my whole range here. This is the pashmina. And don't look for this one on the website because this is Richard's very own. And as each one is hand painted, there's never a reproduction. So he's going to tie it in the way that I teach with that knot that will never come undone. Instructions are in on my website and I, on a postcard too, which I enclose with each purchase. So there is a knot, all done, dead simple. If he can do it, anybody can. And uh, that's my full range. Thanks ever so much, Richard. That's been great. Now, you can see me on www.shellyfaylazar.com. What's that, Richard? www.shellyfaylazar.com. Thank you. It's an unusual name, so if you Google me, you'll find me very easily. All my contact details are there, and it'd be a pleasure to hear from you, or you can order direct from my website. So that's that. Hope you enjoy my our little art gallery as a bonus and I hope and look forward to hearing from you soon. Bye.